Hey Divas, Kaden here. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for the love and support. I really appreciate it. Guys, if you want to see how I went from this yellow blonde to this nice honey blonde you see in the Aww. comfort of your own home, continue to watch. So first thing first, I'm going to need you to run to the beauty supply store and pick up some products. So you're going to be needing some Wella tone toners and some developer. So the first, the Wella toners that I use for this video is the Wella T18 along with the T27 and I mix both in the same container with some 30 volume developer. The mixture that I have, the ratio that's that's recommended is for one bottle of Weller toner to two bottles of developer. So the same bottle that you, you pour the toner from, just use, use that same bottle to measure two bottles of developer. After pouring the contents into the mixing bowl, I'm going to go ahead and mix everything together until it is all blended. Guys, because this unit was bleached the day before, I had to go ahead and um, moisten the unit with some water before applying the mixture. Guys, please don't be lazy like me. Don't forget to wear your gloves. So I'm gonna go ahead and start applying the mixture to the unit. I'm I'm gonna this time I'm gonna be using the brush because I don't have any gloves. I don't want to be all up in the chemicals. So I'm just gonna go ahead use the brush and apply it all over the unit. So I'm basically going track by track, not really track by track, but I'm going and getting every crevices, every creases. I'm just applying it all over to ensure sure that I get everything because I don't want to have any patches. Must I say, I did not go to school for any of this stuff. I'm self-taught so you can keep your trolling self, self to yourself. After applying the toner, I'm going to go ahead with a big paddle brush comb through the unit to ensure that I get the mixture on every single strand. Then let it sit for 30 minutes before rinsing it out. Now, as you can see, the unit is already toned down, but this won't be the, the true color that it gets because right now it looks ashy. So whenever I rinse it out and then put it to air dry, then you'll see the perfect honey blonde that I got.
I'm going to go ahead and wash out the unit using four shampoos. So I'm going to be using the first two from the Ion collection and those are the Ion Moisture, so uh, Moisture Solution Shampoo along with the Ion color solutions shampoo so i'm going to use those two to wash out the unit before going on to the purple shampoos so the purple shampoos that i'll be using is the iron cool blonde color solution shampoo along with the shimmer lights purple shampoo and i'm going to just add those to the unit let them sit for like five to ten minutes before rinsing it out because i want that purple to work on any other brassy tones that left it that's left in the unit i wanted to cancel it completely now i only use shampoos on my colored units because i want to use these to get as much moisture back because when you bleach and dye bundles wigs whatever they lose this moisture and you want to bring that back now with like if i say i I did a natural black unit or a jet black unit all I'll, I'll do to co-wash is just conditioner Now I'm going to go ahead and con condition the unit using the Biosilk Volumizing Therapy Conditioner and I'm going to let that sit on the unit for a little bit before rinsing it out.
Now I'm going to move on and use some silicone mix to deep condition the hair and I'm going to leave it on for 5 minutes before rinsing it out. Here you go guys this is it this is the final result i went ahead and add some um dark roots and don't tell me that it's not giving what it's supposed to give please don't forget to go ahead like comment share and subscribe bye